The New York Aquarium, devastated by Hurricane Sandy in 2012, is now fully reopened after a decade. Today, we're gonna check out this breathtaking renovation, commune with penguins, otters, sharks, and jellyfish, and catch a sea lion show in the outdoor amphitheater. This is Magellan. And this is Greyhound. Well, we make videos about epic road trips, kayaking, hiking, and other outdoor adventures. The New York Aquarium is the oldest running aquarium in the United States. It originally opened in 1896 in Battery Park in Manhattan, but since 1957 has been in Coney Island, Brooklyn. The aquarium makes a great side trip if you're already in Coney Island for the rides and boardwalk, which we've made a video on. When you first enter, you'll go through the main exhibit, the Conservation Hall, which features displays of marine species from the Great Lakes of Africa, the Coral Triangle in the Pacific, and the rainforests of Brazil. Here's the always popular clownfish. These are cichlids from Lake Malawi. This is a Nile perch from Lake Victoria. What is this fish doing? He's just picking up gravel and like yeah, spitting it out, leaving it in places. What's your deal, bro? These are the infamous piranhas, the most ferocious fish in the world, according to former U.S. President Teddy Roosevelt. When in actuality, most piranhas are omnivores, and the ones who aren't typically aren't as aggressive as much as they are portrayed. Locals in Brazil wanted to put on a show for Roosevelt and fed a live cow to an unfed group of piranhas. And so the myth persisted. The next section is outside once you leave the conservation hall, the sea cliffs, where you can check out sea lions, sea otters, seals, and penguins. He's just like this, this, this is my good side, this is my good side. I think he just keeps going around and around in a circle. Oh my god, he's so adorable. These are not Magellanic penguins. You guys are gonna laugh, but you see that white thing in the background? I thought that was some insane water snake, and then I found that it was a hose. We really don't wanna miss the sea lion show at 11 because the next one's at 1.30. I've actually never been to one of these before in my life. This is Bruiser. He's a California sea lion, but a native New Yorker, since he was born at the Bronx Zoo. In case anyone wanted to know where you park your stroller, this is where it is, next to the aqua theater and in front of the spineless and shark exhibits. Also right behind the aqua theater is this unmarked tank with sharks and scuba divers. Maybe this is the site of a future attraction. Our next stop is the Playquarium, a great spot for kids and even adults who want to make sure they are smarter than their sixth grader. 
Here you'll see interactive exhibits and aquatic displays to learn about our oceans, coral reefs, kelp, and of course, toys to buy. <laughs> I have transformed into a giant squid. Spineless is a fairly new exhibit and only about a year old and features all kinds of invertebrate creatures of the ocean. Here you can check out tons of amazing jellyfish, crabs, cuttlefish, and even an octopus. They may not have backbones, but they look pretty cool. The Ocean Wonders Shark Exhibit is another structure that was set to open the same week that Hurricane Sandy hit, and didn't wind up opening until 2018. It's 50,000 square feet with 800,000 gallons of water, and has over 100 different species of fish, such as sharks, rays, and sea turtles. The most notable thing people come for is this tunnel. Not only is it beautiful, but it's awesome, and kinda creepy to watch the fish swim over your head. And Dylan's gonna put his hand in the mouth of the shark. There's this tube you can go through to get a view from under the tank. You know, being a full-fledged adult man-child. Rangers lead the way, all the way. This area highlights shipwrecks and how species such as sharks use them as newfound homes. Yeah, that's not scary or anything. Yo, this is the laziest fish in this whole place. This last section is called Hudson Canyon's Edge, another massive tank with sharks. This is me pretending to be an alpha predator as I mean mug these fearsome creatures. Let us know if you've been to the New York Aquarium and if you've been to other ones like the Aquarium in Monterey or in Chicago, what's your favorite? We'll see you on the trails or in the water. <laughs>